welcome to the 12th and final tutorial in this series of painting basics, where you have discovered how to paint various garments with a tetrachrome palette. In this lesson, we'll be looking at how to paint gold garments, such as those worn by the infant Christ. This technique is also used for objects such as thrones, footstools, jars, angels' wings, and more. So besides painting a garment, we'll also be painting a jar as an example. This technique can be done with paint or with gold leaf. And when using gold leaf, it is often called a cyst or chrysocondylia in Greek. But before you can try to do this with gold size, you first need to become familiar with this technique. This technique requires painting fine parallel or radiating lines that start thicker and end at a point. It's important that these lines are not painted randomly, but rhythmically, forming a harmonious whole. So before we actually start painting the garment and jar, we'll first do a warm-up exercise to familiarize you with the basic brush strokes. This garment includes a variety of folds, giving us the opportunity to see how we can do the assist on each of them. Here on the sleeve, I create a form similar to a regular sleeve. And there we have our garments and jar with simple assist. I hope you've enjoyed this tutorial and this series. I hope that you will join me in the next series on painting hair and beards. Until then, keep practicing. Yeah.